Hey brother, I'm an activist down here showing how the police are handling the situation with the homeless down here. It's an unfortunate situation. Yeah. You got a story you want to share? Let me ask you, my name, first of all, let me tell you, my name's Phil. I'm not putting you on the, on the camera because I respect, that's why I asked. If you want to tell a story, to share it, and you want me to allow it for you to share it, then I, I will share it. Um, uh, I've had that same shirt before. <laughs> You've had this shirt yeah. before? No. Um, uh, are you, is this something that you're working on? This is, I, I have a YouTube channel. Beautiful. And uh, I go out and I, uh, show good and bad of what's going on and uh, I want to show transparency I film I record yeah. the cops nice. uh, and this right now is what uh, I'm showing I'm showing about how this isn't the solution of moving people yeah. you know you've been you what's your name freed 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 nice to meet you nice to meet you brother. Uh, you've been homeless how long about two years, two years? Yeah. You're from here? Yeah, no. I uh, moved here from Atlanta, Georgia. Georgia? Uh, yeah. You have any assistance or any source of income from the county? Uh, the, yeah, I get um, uh, food stamps and general relief. Okay. Um, which is about 400 bucks a month. Okay, 400, which obviously goes mostly to food, huh? Yeah. <laughs> you have any um, family or friends? My mom lives here as well, but she lives in her car. She lives in her car too, huh? Yeah. So your mother lives in her car, you live on the streets. She lives here too in Venice? Yeah. Wow. Um, uh, we we uh, somewhat support ourselves uh, by digging through the trash. Right. And um, collecting uh, items that, uh, that we then sell. Okay. Or trade or give away. Okay. So let me ask you, uh, Free, when the police come here, it's on a certain day and they make everybody leave and then they come back and do the same thing? Yeah, you know, twice a week. Twice a week? Yeah. Is there um, a certain time they do it? Uh, usually really early in the morning. Do they ever put hands on people down here? Physical? Uh, no. No. Good. No. Good. Do they treat you at least with respect? Uh, 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 somewhat it depends on which uh, team is working. It, were, um, it, it, it matters which team, which officers come here, huh? Yeah, which officers, which of the sanitation workers um, come that you know decide you know whether they're gonna throw away everything or or help us, you know. Gotcha. Um, Gotcha. Yeah. No, it should be universal. Everybody should be treating everybody with respect yeah. and dignity down here. Where do you live here? Um, uh, on this side. But... Down here. Okay. Well, thank you for sharing that, man. Things things have to get better they will at, get at some point. The problem we have right now is too much money is going into infrastructure rather than resources yeah. to help the homeless. And until that changes... Uh, nothing's gonna change so even me out here it's not gonna change anything but I can expose it you are changing it brother we all are everything well I'm, I'm doing I'm doing my small part so with that free give you a fist bump and let you have a blessed day bro take care Hey, Sino. Hey, what's up, bro? How you doing? You're all dressed up now. So.
I'm, I'm an activist, fellas. I'm down here to show how these guys disrespect the homeless. That's okay. At least if I get run over, it's for a good cause. How are you doing, buddy? Good, man. I'm Arkansas. What's your name? Arkansas. Arkansas. Nice meeting you. My name's Phil. Nice to meet you, Bill. Yeah. So uh, I'm down here to show and to hear because just taking everybody's possessions isn't the solution. Right. It just makes us mad. Yeah, it makes you mad, of course. So you've, Arkansas, you've been uh, homeless how long? Ever since I've been in California, I've been here since, uh, I've been Venus since uh, September last year. Last year, huh? Yeah. You got some, uh, some uh, county assistance? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So what, what's what's the solution? What's the solution? Hey, hey look. Hold up, ask the three million at Disney. Let me talk to this man. Ask Cecil and goddamn Cecil Samuel. Say go see him. Yeah. I never take. Let me talk to him, Cecil. Shit, no, wait. You know I'm an old man out Washington. If you act it, give me an autograph of a million dollars, thousand million dollars, thousand million dollars. <laughs> right now, now. See but the solution. Shit, the solution I, is I, not I, to I, take I, everybody's stuff. Or force us out of this or force you out. The solution is to get more resources for people. They, they opened this bridge, uh, bridge shelter over here. Yeah. The other day uh, or last week, and uh, it's got it's got a lot of resources in there uh, for people who want it. Who want it, and there's right. a lot who don't because because they have the restrictions. You can't smoke in there. You can't drink in there. But that's okay. Right. Well, a lot of people. Here, let's get the A lot place. of people don't think it's okay. That's why they don't want to take it. I smoke. I don't drink, but you know, I and I do other other stuff too. You know. I know not to take it in there because then people are trying to help us. There you go. You know? So you got to respect that. You know, and and I do. Uh, so are you living there now? Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm transitioning between here. And there, gotcha. you know, I, I still got stuff out here that, that I got to do. Fuck and, your and stuff out here. That con rabbit, cause you killed my mama rat, and came out here stole my wife and child. Actually, you're Okay, all right, thank you. Thank yeah, but red ten red. Oh, there's a businessman right there. I like that. Yeah, he, he does his own. He does his own thing, man. He uh, uh goes around here. He, he, he normally does his at night. All right, Zagabo. Uh, yeah, so, uh, well, that's, that, that's, that's a start. You know, for me, I choose to be out here. You know, I, I came out here from Arkansas after I served out of, out of prison out there. Uh-huh. Uh, they told me I can go anywhere I wanted to go. Right. And I told them, I said, well, I've never been to California. And, you know, I knew coming out here I was going to be homeless. Uh, okay. And, uh, you know, it, it's, I'm 49. 49, uh, huh? Yeah, and... To me, just being out here is way better than being in the penitentiary. Well, I can't argue. <laughs> I can't argue with that. Right. And you know, I, I've met some interesting people along the way. Uh, you know, I yeah. You know, I want to. I, I don't want to stay on the street forever. No. But I don't want to be forced into doing something I don't want to do. Understood. Or forced into doing something that I already got planned, but I ain't, I ain't prepared for it yet. You know, you got to prepare for your journey. You got to prepare for your journey. Those are right. true, true words, Arkansas. Yeah. All right, brother. Well, with that, right. take care of yourself. I'm gonna brother. let you roll. All right, thank Me, you. I should be having a job in sales. I'm looking to uh, I'm gonna start with used cars. I'm gonna get back into sales again. Here in the next couple of weeks, thanks to the transition center up here. Nice. They just opened up and allowed us a, a clean shower every day. Which, you, which you have to have for work, uh, clean water. Beautiful um, I story. have an infection in my leg because of the dirty seed water. They're, they did provide us with water down here, which I appreciate, but I have a dog bite infection right here. Oh. So anyway, now that I'm healing and I'm, I'm ready to get back to work. You get, you're, I'm, you're I'm on getting, your way. Yeah. What's I, your name? I, I better not say. Okay, Thank well, you. Uh, you don't have to say. I'm gonna just call you the nice lady with the pies. <laughs> That's good. All, All right, over. you guys take care. Right, Actually, my name is Joey. Joey, nice talking to you. My name is Phil. What kind of pie was that? Caramel. Salt, caramel, pudding pie. Nice. Have a good one. And 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 
the future is good because you got work coming. Okay, take care, Jody. Bye. Well, there's a positive ending to that. There is hope. Besides that, death on records, rapid charges, charges, and Tim Mara. Tia Tamara. Happy related anniversary. Have a good one. Hey officer. Hey, how's it going? Good man. Well, I called him officer by mistake. God bless you. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. So, are the police coming today? I don't know. We haven't seen them yet. That's crazy. That's unusual because they're usually here at 6 a.m. 6 o'clock a.m. 6 o'clock? Yes, tell everybody to put down their tent. And they do that twice a week? No, they do that every day. Every day? Yeah. You got to put down your tents every day. You got to put down the tents every day. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it's crazy. They can't put them up until night. Not till they're not put them up until nine. From six a.m. to nine p.m. Six a.m. to nine. Got to keep it clean. Then they come back and have you. Uh, is there? Let me. I'm just curious. Is there a reason you didn't want to take up the? Uh, hey, morning, man. Uh, go into the uh, shelter. Yeah. Oh no, I'm not homeless. Oh. I'm here helping. Oh. I used to be homeless. Oh, God bless you. Yeah. I live in Santa Monica. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, so your life changed. Yeah, yeah. And I always come on help. How, what was, uh, what was the reason how your life changed that you were homeless? Um, lost my job, lost my boyfriend, which I really relied on, you know. And I worked too, but you know, it was like I was in a relationship for a long time. Okay, so but you became homeless. So what changed that now you're off the street? Oh, shoot, I got housing. You got housing. Yeah, through um, being homeless over on in Manchester Square. Okay. I was homeless over there, and um, I got a, uh, uh, you know, like when they give you, I got low income housing. But right. I got housing, and um, I was waiting to get my voucher, but I got low income housing. Right, so Section Eight. A, yeah. Right. It's, it's kind of a difference, but. Um, where I live is really nice. It's downtown Santa Monica. Yeah, I know, I know. Yeah. Step, Upscale. Yep, step, step, step up on second. That's well, right. you know what? What's your name? Tammy. Tammy, my name's Phil. Oh, <laughs> I'll give you a handshake. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I gave sure. you a fist bump. No, that's cool, that's cool. Hey, fist bump and a handshake. Now we're friends. Yeah, I'm like a success story. Um, if you look up me and Tammy Johnson on um, LA Times, Okay. They did a couple of interviews with me. Okay. Tammy Johnson uh, in the LA Times. How long ago? Um, this was like 2016, 17. Okay. 2016, 2017. Everybody go to the Los Angeles Times to read the story of Tammy Johnson's. Uh, homeless in um, Manchester Square. Homeless in Manchester Square. Okay. And then, then it's a little topic that says there's no, no, there's nowhere else for us to go. You know? Well, this isn't, this just is, this is the biggest problem we have right now yeah. in this country. So, do, yeah. how often do you come down here? 
Um, like twice a week. Twice a week. Yeah. How do you get here by bus? No, I ride my bike from here. Wow, you're in good shape. Yeah. Because yeah. that's a ways. No, no, Santa Monica is not a ways. Well, how far? A couple miles? Yeah. I mean, on the boardwalk, it take you what, ten minutes. Oh, okay. You're not from out here? Yeah, you know what? I, I got confused. I, I got confused. I thought you were riding from Manchester Square. Oh, no, no, and no, And then you no, told me no. the story. Uh, that was 2016. This is why I got to stop drinking so early in the morning. <laughs> I get confused. Do what you handle your scandal. <laughs> yep, that's it. Okay, Tammy. All right. Very nice talking to you. Okay. God bless you for everything you're doing. Well, thank you. Uh, God will bless me for this. Yep, yep. You know, because he knows my heart. It's all good. Yeah, but I know how it is. And that, you know, people get distracted. And, you know, so I want to keep it clean for them so they don't have such a hard time. Right. Because they'll give them a hard time if they keep it messy like this. They won't give them anything, you know? And everybody's grown here. <laughs> yeah, it's uh. I wish they could take that with my responsibility knowing that, you know? But anyway, it's nice talking to you. Nice talking to you. Maybe I'll see you next time, too. Okay. Take care, Tammy. You take, you take care, too. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Bye-bye. Hey fellas, what, what, so you guys come, you're the clean team of Venice, yes, and, you, and, and you come down here to clean the streets, what, for, uh, I was talking to this lady here from, uh, every day from 9, uh, you, you, you're generally down here, well she said 9, but you guys are at 10, and then they clean them, uh, they can't have their tents here until ten, 9 at night, is that it? Uh, that's, so, so what, city, city law, city rules? City law. We just come in here. Take care of what we gotta do, take care of the trash cans and so, do our job. Let, let me ask you, I know you're making a living and you gotta do it. Is this a solution you think? No. What do you think the solution is for this man? For this? Yeah. Housing. Yeah. More more money into resources. Housing. And a lot, but you know, a lot of people don't wanna go into the housing. Housing and treatment. And treatment. Yeah. You've been doing it how long? This job? A year, maybe? A year? Okay. Yeah. Thanks for taking see, the t time, I, man. I, I, I come from being out here, not here, but, you know. For so you live this life? A little bit, yeah, you can say that. But I got, I got myself better through treatment. Nice. And, you know. Nice. Yeah. So, well, you know. It's up to, it's, it's, at the end of the day, it's up to the person who really, really wants to change their life. Well, I mean, that's it, man. You know, yeah. a lot don't. Yeah. A lot of them don't. That's the main problem. And uh, the addiction is real, man. Every day you're out here doing this, huh? Yeah. Then what? You you just, this is your streets here? Is this? Yeah, we have a bid right here. What What is it? What What are the main streets here that this is? Uh, second, third, or? Hampton, third, fourth, but back on the, on the speedway. Couple Hampton, areas. third, and fourth in the speedway, huh? Speedway, a couple All areas. Right. All right, buddy. All right. Nice talking to you. Yeah, Appreciate yeah. you taking the time. Right. I'll let you get back at it. Yeah. <laughs> well, you got to be careful, don't you? Yeah, you, we got to. You got to pick it up, like maybe needles. And yeah, that's like. the main. That's the main. That's the main part. That's the main thing for us. I mean, it's dangerous too. What yeah. you're doing. Yeah. Do you have any stories? You know of any workers that got pricked by dirty needles? Uh, no. We, Thank goodness. We're usually uh, on point when it comes to that. You got to have good eyesight. Yeah, exactly. All right. All right, guys, I'll All right. let you go. All right. Take care. Yeah. <laughs>